previously on Apprentice A. Apprentice House. They're dogs, you kind of think of them as kids. We're still living in boxes. One last McDonald's trip for old time's sake. Oh, baby! So echoey. Okay, now we'll get it. <laughs> well, we'll it. The kettle's $170. Let's get it. I love it. Good afternoon. Um, we have to set up for Play the Future, which means the house is even more of a disaster than it was yesterday. Everything had to be moved in here, so now we have twice as many boxes in this space. Now it's a mess. Now it's a serious mess. Just so we could open this up and get in here and film some stuff. So I gotta build a desk and put some stuff in here, set up the gear. Injury number one. I caught it though. Baby. Yeah, I know. Make it better. Okay. It's dripping. All right. Sorry for screeching about blood. Water, just thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Step one, water. Step two, dry, okay. Dr. Sasky in the house. Whoa. Don't say whoa. Don't say whoa. What do you mean whoa? It's huge. <laughs> oh man, that is pretty okay, big. It's okay, I got you a special band-aid. Okay, you might need to. It's wet, it's not gonna stick. Is it still wet? Oh no, it's not wet, sorry. I lied. Just kidding. There's one. Okay. So you need another is this one? a Pac-Man band-aid? Yeah. That's awesome. Okay, I'm gonna grab another Pac-Man band-aid. Okay, only if it's a Pac-Man band-aid, I only want it. Okay. This is why you have a box of essentials. The box of essentials that it says open open immediately? Yeah. It has things like band-aids in it. You hurry up, I'm dying here. Oh, baby. There you go. Thank you. Welcome. Now I can't bend my thumb, but that's, that's okay. okay. Who needs your thumb? This thing kind of started rolling off the table, and I reached for it. I caught it. Thanks for catching But I think, like, this little... There's, like, a little nick there where, like, things connect. I think that caught it, and then it just, like, sliced up my thumb. Thanks for saving my life. You're welcome. You look great. The lighting is good. <laughs> Thanks. So you might be hearing this whistling in the background. Somebody's vacuuming outside. No one's vacuuming outside. At all times, 24-7. That whistling is coming from that door. So, some things I learned. Um, when you're in a condo building, or any type of building that is tall, every floor has air intakes, right? Like they have air conditioning, they're all pumping air onto the floor to keep it either just to keep the air fresh, or to keep it cold, or keep it warm. And all that air that gets pumped through the hallways has to go somewhere. And if everyone's door on that hallway is closed, where's all that air that's being pumped in? Where does it go? Well, it eventually finds its way through like under cracks of doors, up elevator shafts, etc., etc. And then you have every floor has this, and it all goes up. <laughs> so when you're high up, as you can tell, <laughs> um, all that air hits the top and then has nowhere else to go and it has to go somewhere so it starts fighting its way through the cracks of the door because of all the pressure built up like an airplane. So all this air pressure has just come up from every floor underneath and it's like well I gotta go somewhere because you can't go, can't go much higher so it shoves in through the cracks in the window and then just goes through like our vents or if we have a door open it goes through there. So there's this weird pressure thing which is kind of neat. I just wish the door was like like a storm door There's like just kind of sucked into the wall but we gotta find a way to not have it do that because if you open the door then there's a breeze and it's not like a breeze it's like you can do like a L'Oreal hair commercial because it's just like a stream of hair. It's true! It's so much wind that the microphone will just be like So, you know, problems. Problems to be solved. Set's done. It's done and lit. And lit very well. Let's take a look. One. Two. We did it with only three lights. Three. There we go. da 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 the person sits in the middle, where the chair is, obviously. It looks pretty good. We realized we forgot to put the top on. That was a mistake, but what can you do? We already filmed it. Thanks for doing the other half of the dishes for me. I did all the pots and pans, Saskia did all the plates. Yeah, 
I did nothing. Mark. Stephanie did nothing. Yeah. Yeah. Stephanie just ate our food. I did. Good. I just came and ate your food because I missed you guys. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. It's been so long. She came and she was part of Play the Future, so I you're going to be up in the next episode that goes up tomorrow. Yes. Yes? You should yes. know. You're the Quest producer. Work? Yes. Tomorrow. Yes. Good. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for swinging by. Thanks. And thanks for eating all my food. Thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> I'm going to make some hot water. I think I'm going to have some Tim Morton's candy cane hot chocolate because I can. It's been a, it's been a day. And uh, right now I am just about to start editing uh, a video. Saskia's already editing most of Play the Future, right? Did you already finish? Um, I mean, I can only edit so much, but I'm still missing the person. Right. Corey's gonna come and film. Yeah, Corey's on his way. And then we're gonna film with him. So everything is edited. Lots of editing. And then, like, put together, but it's cutting from you to you to you. Yeah, cutting from me to me to me is not a good idea. As much as I like it, Maybe we should switch it up a bit. We just finished editing some videos yeah, and I, doing some filming and such. Yeah, I got just two hanging out. videos edited ready two? to go That's good. for the fishing channel. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> there's a stranger on a balcony. I bet there's no one there. I don't, I don't know. know. Where did that heart come from? I don't, I don't understand. <laughs> Where did that heart come from? <laughs> Your windows are dirty. How did you get on our balcony? I'm spiking it. Did you climb up? Yeah. That's impressive, actually. Thanks. Good. All the way to the 40th floor. <laughs> I'm gonna go to bed. Saskia's already gone. She's brushing her teeth. I'm tired. Tomorrow, I think, is, uh... I think I've got one thing to do tomorrow on my list. I have, like, one meeting or a phone call. One thing. And then other than that, I think tomorrow's going to be a good day for unpacking, finally. Because we did Play the Future today. I did all some fishing videos, got those edited. So tomorrow we're going to unpack. Finally. <laughs> Alright, I went to bed. Good night, and we'll see you guys.